like Whirlpool sucking like the... Well, think about it like this. Let's say the space-time continuum is the sea and the black hole is the Whirlpool. It it's, sucks everything near it into it and no one really knows what happens inside the black hole but the black hole has the strongest force ever known in the universe. It's gravity, so it literally tears apart whatever goes into it. I see you've got lots of equipment here. Can you tell me a little bit about your project? Sure. So my project is on blue, and my experiment is on the strength of these three glues. So these are uh, homemade blues. Yeah. <laughs> and this one's a gelatin, and it turned hard like gel. Um, it's like made out of blue. Uh, no, no, jello. Jello. Yeah. So that's how I turned it. Uh, and so I thought you can get so that the milk glue wants to yes, and then the the gelatin. But we actually found out that the gelatin sucks best because it turns solid afterwards, so it's harder to peel off together. Well, I really like how you had a hypothesis to start with, and, and you experimented to find out if that hypothesis is true. Or not. So well done, you're a great little scientist, a young scientist. So thank you very much. Your project is called Roses Forever. So, um, would you recommend then that um, to prevent aging, we might want to use vitamin E yeah. on our skin? Yeah. 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 So this is very good for an old person like me. I need to know about these things. So, did you enjoy doing the project? Yeah, it was really fun. Your project is called Explosion of Colors. That sounds really interesting. Well, tell me about the project. Okay, so what you do is you have some milk, and it has to be settled, otherwise the food coloring will move around and it'll sort of lose the effect a little bit. So, and then you drip each color of food coloring just one time into a little thing, and then you take one of these and you just dip it in the soap. And then you dip it in the center of one of the food coloring, and then it sort of bursts. Really? Yeah. So I can see why you wear gloves. Now. Yeah. It's a good idea to wear gloves and old raggedy and, clothes. And what grade are you in? I'm in grade five. Wow. Oh wow! Look at that. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> And, yeah.